the numbers really are staggering. This is the University Boulevard corridor, lots of pedestrians, lots of traffic. In the last 10 years, 142 people have been killed in this transportation corridor who were pedestrians struck by vehicles. At this intersection alone, 15th Avenue, that number is 26, including the man who was struck and killed by a police officer last night. It was about nine last night when the walker trying to get across University Boulevard near this intersection was struck and killed by an unmarked police vehicle. The accident remains under investigation and police have released few details, except to say the officer was not responding to a call at the time. In the epidemic of pedestrian accidents along University Boulevard, this counts as the second time a pedestrian has been hit and killed by a police car in this area since 2016 accident records show. <laughs> this is a majority Latino community, densely populated with large numbers of people who walk to do their daily business in an area where crosswalks can be spaced up to a quarter mile apart. University Boulevard is six lanes across, not counting left turn lanes. Pedestrians have to negotiate narrow, crumbling sidewalks. Many have been struck on the side of the road, according to a 2016 investigation by the Capitol News Service that documented a shocking number of pedestrian accidents and few improvements by highway planners. The area is currently being prepared for construction of the financially troubled Purple Line Light Rail Project. Jersey walls and utility construction complicate matters for pedestrians and drivers. The Purple Line will come with pedestrian improvements, including barrier fencing, reduced traffic lanes, and improved crosswalks and signals. But the project is now delayed as the state and the primary contractor have argued over cost overruns. Completion is now targeted for 2023. So, Improvements are on the way, but 2023, that is a long wait in this troubled transportation corridor where on average in the last 10 years, 14 pedestrians are getting struck and killed every year. Reporting live in Langley Park, Scott Broom, WUSA 9. It gets darker earlier. We all have to be on alert. Scott, thank you.